Hi guys, my name is Janmin Lissondra and today I will be demonstrating on how I painted this um, painting. It is a cityscape painting in which you can learn how to paint on buildings, the city lights, the moonlight, and the water reflections. But before that, I'm going to introduce to you my materials. I have here my paint palette. So I have the titanium white, the tallow blue, the brilliant red, the medium, little, the medium yellow, and the lamp black. So you observe guys that I'm always using um, limited colors on my palette because I want you to learn how to mix and get the desired colors you want. And it is also one way of learning um, how to paint guys. Okay, so. And these are my brushes my brushes guys so I have here the two inches flat brush the one inch flat brush the number seven flat brush number four flat brush number two round brush and number one liner brush or round brush for the details this is my canvas guys it's 12 by 16 inches it has three cuts of prime gesso I made it myself and water guys to thin the paint okay so i'm going i'm gonna start doing the the background first here the sky the dark the dark sky then i'm going i think i'm gonna put the moon here on the right side and the water here the sea and the reflections and the buildings here in the center of the canvas okay so let's start first by using the Num uh, two inches flat brush so first guys dip the tip of your brush into the water to make it a little wet so that it will flow um, uh, freely on your canvas okay so now I'm gonna use the blue hopefully you can you can apply the blue um, directly it's okay guys we, we just mix the colors with black to make it dark and with a little amount of red I'm going to make this sky really dark but my water, my painter is too wet so it's not good it's honestly not good so I think I'm going to clean my brush first ok I'm going to add a little, a little amount of water a oh, white to make it lighter, I'm going to put it here small amount of white with lots, lots of blue and black with a little amount of red okay so just follow everything I did guys or what I'm doing here gonna add more red and black so I'm going to put directly the black at the top to make that top part um, darker blue and red to make this part darker the sky guys should be darker okay and, and white more blue and red so you just have to play and blend the colors guys okay now i'm gonna add more black and more blue and red more blue and red okay and also here guys on the bottom I'm gonna add more black and blue here hopefully guys you should make the water um, darker than the sky hopefully just what I'm Observe 
on the real um, scene. I'm gonna add white to make it lighter here. Blue and black. Just play with the colors, guys. And just have to blend it smoothly. There's no other special technique in blending these colors. Blue and black. Let's apply it here guys Okay, I just have to blend the colors here. So we'll be here, I'm going to... Here. So this part will be the city. Okay. Now I'm gonna be touch on the upper part. I'm going to use more blue and black here. More blue and black and red. Okay, so I'll just blend here guys, the top of it, the top part, okay, you just have to blend the colors, and I'm gonna add white, make it lighter, I'll just blend it smoothly guys. I added a little white to make it tighter. And here also. Okay, and I think I'm going to make this part tighter also. I just have to mix it with lighter color. So remember, guys, the the direction of my strokes. Uh, this should be a little. Um, it should be horizontal. Okay. Okay, that's it. So I'm going to add some dark color on the background, guys, and I'm going to um, show that it's mountains, so black. So I'm gonna use the blue and the black. You can dip the tip of your brush, guys, in the water to make it um, wet, make it a little wet. And also, we can use the red here. 
So, it should be darker, guys. Okay. This part should be a little darker. But I added a little white to make it um, lighter, of course. Added a little white to make it lighter. Not all guys, we'll just cover this part with the buildings. So it doesn't matter if you emphasize this part. So I'm gonna use the black and blue again. So this, yeah, just do it that way. Black, no blue, and black again. Here, okay. Another black. And red to make this part darker. Okay. Oh, that's it guys so i think i am done with my first coating so next i'm gonna let it dry first for at least five minutes then i'm gonna add some details on the buildings city lights and the moon here and of course the reflection okay so let it dry first for at least five minutes okay guys so i I think the paint is already dry now and I'm going to start adding the details. I'm going to start with the moon and the buildings here with the city lights. Okay, so I'm, I'm going I am going to use the smaller brush, the one, number one liner brush for uh, for the details of the moon. And I'm going to use the white with a little amount of blue. Okay, just white guys and a little amount of blue and I will apply it here, just mix it and I will apply it directly here on the right side. So I'm going to make it out uh, big. Okay. Uh, make it circle perfectly circle okay Okay, that's it. Okay, you just have to, to make it um, solid guys, the color. Yeah, I think that's it. Some more, make it um, circle. Okay, that's it. No, okay. That's it. And now I'm going to start adding the the details here on the um, city lights and buildings. So I'm going to use a different brush. I'm gonna use the I think a bigger brush, guys, the number seven flat brush. And I'm going to add lights here first. 
and use the white um, with a little amount of yellow uh, some yellowish lights and blue just a little amount guys to make it a little blue green and I'll just apply it directly here make it straight guys okay and make sure your brush don't do not wet your brush guys it should be dry okay just uh, blend the colors using the dry brush technique so that means that you don't have, you don't have to wait the do, to wet the brush or do not do not dip it to the water okay yeah and also here need to add more I have to add wet a little, so that's bad. So just do not using my fingers. Okay, that's it. Yeah. Okay, now I'm going to add um little details. Um, the I think the I'm going to add the the buildings, and I'm gonna use the um the number four flat brush. Okay, and I'm going to do first a lighter color building. So I'm gonna use the white guys, and a little amount of blue and black to make it grayish. Okay, so now just perfectly add a tall building in the center on this part. This will be a tall building, guys. Okay. You can wet your brush to make it um, fluid. It's gonna be a very big building, guys. Okay, so I'm gonna make this part lighter. So I'm gonna use the white to add light on this bottom. Okay. Make it straight. Yeah, that's it. And also on the right side, guys. I make it uh, lighter. Yeah, that's it. What else? I'm gonna add uh, smaller buildings. And I'm gonna add some bluish color or uh, blue, um, light blue, sky blue. So just use the blue guys with white. Then I'm gonna add uh, bluish uh, four buildings with blue color here. 
This one is a little smaller. We just let it dry before we're gonna add more details in that paper. Okay. And I'm gonna add uh, perspective on this building. Okay, that's it. Now I'm gonna add more buildings with a uh, um, green color, so blue, no, um, black, white, and with a little amount of blue. I'm gonna uh, build more buildings. So on the, yeah, I'm gonna add more on the, um on the back part here we're gonna add um, higher buildings uh, and I think bigger okay We're gonna add some details later. This building is a lot bigger than the other two. Okay. I will add more buildings here. Also, some smaller. Yeah. And I think I'm going to add more, more and more. So again, guys, I'm gonna mix for the bluish gray color buildings. So yeah, we have the uh, different colors. Okay, and the back, and here also. These are the darker colors, guys. Darker bluish color, and here. Okay. Add some more here. Okay. Yep. Yeah. And to add lighter color, so I'm gonna just add white to make it lighter. And here also. To add a taller but small. Okay. Yeah. 
here let's add uh, smaller values ok then add white guys to um, lighter color and I think here I'm going to put one This one is smaller building. Smaller but tall. Okay. I'm going to add lighter building. So I'm going to just use white guys to make it lighter. And we'll just add here. Yeah. What else? So, I think that add more. Yeah. What else, guys? So, I'm gonna add darker buildings here and on this part I'm going to add smaller ones yeah here and here also else I think that's enough so I'm going to start adding some details on the buildings I'm gonna, uh, first I'm gonna do this one so I'm gonna use the black guys with a little amount of blue with white so not so not so dark guys this is enough okay and I'm gonna add some details here so just lines guys, horizontal lines okay and also here Just uh, yeah. Just follow what I'm doing, guys. Yeah. Can blend the colors here. You can, you can spread using your fingers
Okay. That's it. Yeah, also. Yeah. And this one also, guys, the blue one. So these are the details. It's in color, guys. Huh? little details so just just lines guys just um um just add um lines like the windows square lines something like that you don't have to make it um detailed just you just have a uh, one art for this tutorial okay so also here Same guys, the same uh, the same details from the other buildings. Yeah. It doesn't have to be so perfect guys. You just have to create some illusions on our paintings to make it look like a building. This one also just have to put the uh, horizontal lines. That's the horizontal lines. And this one. Okay. So I just have to put um, details. Yeah. Yeah. And this one also. Yeah. That's it. Okay. I'm thinking what and I'm going to add more okay so I'm going to add more lights guys on this um, building so I'm gonna add more lights anywhere okay and I'm going to put some uh, red and white lights so I'm gonna use the white I'm going to add here okay. and in the top of this building guys I'm gonna add white okay that's gonna be the lights guys from the buildings Add more white lights, guys. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. So I just add some lights guys. Yeah. Okay. 
and this also. Not more um, lights coming from the windows of this building. Okay. More lights here. Mm -hmm. And this also. Okay. Does here. This one. This one is the power. Okay. Yeah. And some more lights here in the bottom. Okay. Here also. I'm gonna add more light space. Okay. Here. Okay. More lights. Okay. Just add some dot color, guys, to create lights. So you have now the lights. There, so here also. Okay. And here. Can add more street lights, guys. Later, we're gonna add more colors on our street lights. Yeah, also. Yeah. Yeah. Forget this. There are no special techniques and educating this um, painting this um, city um, city what do you call this um, city cityscape. We have to add lights, lots of lights. So this how we do it. We don't have to make up uh, to perfectly um, add precise colors. We should continue adding um, the street lights using the small brush. Okay. 
this. Yeah, what that? Okay, what else? So I'm gonna add um more um like uh, another color that guys like orange. So I'm gonna use the red and yellow to make some orange colors and white more yellow. I'm gonna add more colors here. Okay. And also yeah. yeah that's it so we just add uh, lots of colors like what I'm doing so just follow everything I did guys so what I'm doing here if you're not playing with me, then add yellow lights. Okay, more yellow. Yeah. So I'm gonna add some yellowish lights in these buildings. Yeah. Do you think? Okay. I'll add more yellow. Now add more yellow here. Just have to spray the colors, guys. Okay. And I think I'm gonna I'm going to add other colors like um like um red. So just use the red guy, the pure red. I just have to spray the colors here. You just have to um specifically create an object guys. Like the cars, the, st the street lights or whatever you see in the city we just have to make an um, just like this part like um, dotted objects to create an impression like this one okay and i think i'm going to add uh, some blue light so i'm gonna use the blue and the yellow Lighter. Okay. So more white. Okay. How about that? Yeah, I think that's that is like a city now. Yeah. You can actually add more details guys, but I think that's enough for me. Yeah. Wait, I'm going to add some some oh, red lights, yellow lights here on top. Yeah. Now, what do you think? What else I'm gonna add? So, I'm gonna add some dark colors, guys. And I'm gonna use the black. Some black with blue. And blue here. And also on the buildings. Okay. 
you know, sum 3, then add sum 3 here. Okay. Some small objects in front of the city. Okay. What else? I think I'm gonna add more small lights. Yeah, I guess some small lights. Yeah, just just use the blue white guys. And create some dot uh, white dot strokes to create more lights. Okay. Just have to add more lights. Okay. Yeah, that's it. So it's like a city now. So what else? I think I'm going to start adding the the reflections now. So I'm gonna use a smaller brush guys. I think the uh, number four flat brush and I'm gonna use the white with a little bluish in color here. Okay. And you just have to to create some um this uh what do you call this uh Horizontal small strokes from top to bottom guys So I just have to create a reflection from this building Or you can use um, um, Vertical strokes from top to bottom like this one Yeah And also this one Yeah I think we're gonna use this procedure. We're gonna do first the vertical strokes before adding the horizontal. Okay. This one also. And I think also the sun or the moon. Yeah. Also here and this building. So just copy everything on top, guys. Whatever lights you see on the top. So just make um horizontal strokes. Like what I'm doing. Okay. You also. Yeah. Later we're gonna add more lights on that. Okay. Here. So just follow what I'm doing guys. So in doing this guys, we just have to create um, horizontal strokes. Oh no, vertical, vertical strokes. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, uh, what else? 
I'm gonna add more highlights using the white. So just use the plain white guys. More horizontal white strokes. Yeah. I'm gonna add more. friction on the building guys so here and this one also okay some city light reflections Okay. And also guys some yellow reflections, so we're gonna use the yellow here. I'm gonna do first the orange, so just use the yellow and the red, red white. Some orange, gonna add red. More yellow. Yellow reflection. Okay. Mm. That's it. Yeah, it's it like a very um. I think it's very clear water. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna retouch the the moon, guys. I'm gonna add more white. Just don't make it solid guys. Just like the moon guys, you see some craters. Okay. And I'm gonna use the white guys to add some uh, more 
uh, on this part of the reflections so, some horizontal lines here okay here also Just use the white guys and create some horizontal short lines or not so short lines but uh, just enough. Okay, now I'm going to add some um, disturbance in the water. So I'm gonna use the bigger brush guys here and I'm gonna use the darker color, the blue and uh, the black. And I'm gonna add some some waves here okay and also okay so I'm gonna use again the black with blue and white Just um, long horizontal lines, guys. And just follow the thing I did, or what I'm doing. Okay. And make it soft guys and do not push it too hard just soft just enough to to create these lines okay about that yeah i think i'm almost done so i think i'm going to add some stars just few few stars guys to to complete this painting so just use I'm just you I'll just use the white here using the smaller brush guys the number number one liner brush and just make the some dots small dots of stars okay So here, and here, there also. Adding more stars. Okay. Let's make some more dots. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Yeah, and I think I'm going to add some falling stars here. Some meteorites. yeah that's it okay i think i am done with my 
um, seascape painting um, tutorial so that's all guys <laughs> yeah it's just a very um, easy um, um, demo uh, demonstration how to paint the the or a, a cityscape or a moonlight or city landscape yeah you just have to make it simpler if you want to make it um, more um, details guys you just have to add more lights more lights or more buildings to make it more uh, realistic and because you can and you also need to copy or find some reference to make it or to copy to make it more um, realistic okay so i'll just show you on how to make one it's just basic and simple um, applying the colors okay guys i want to say thank you so much for watching this video and please um my advice guys is to keep on painting to keep on practicing the more you'll do it the more you will know how to use the brush and the more you will know how to mix the colors and please practice more so please hit like add some comments and subscribe for more videos in the future and if you want to paint with me just follow everything i did in this video and once again guys thank you very much and have a nice day